So this I feel is something I've been looking for a long time. Hey guys, welcome back. This is Miss Lauren Lee 11. And as you can see, I got my little fringe thing going on here. Now, today is something different. As you know, it's summertime. I ombre my hair a few months back. Now what I do is, in the summer, I usually lighten my hair, but the first initial light that I do, it comes out pretty brown. So I went back and I redid my hair. And here are the results. So I just took it up a bit further. It's just a bit more noticeable. And I love it guys. I didn't want it like peroxide bleach blonde, but this is a nice color I've got going on here and I really like it. So leading on to my hair being colored, as you know, I've been looking for wash and go products for the summer that are gonna work well with my hair. I have a gels, butters, puddings. When I went to the Afro Hair and Beauty Hair Festival back in May, um, I ran into Palmer's Cocoa Butter. So if any of you are familiar with, you know, the body creams, they also do hair products for natural hair. Now, their hair products, I tried samples of, and I really, really like them. And I've just literally just co-washed with their conditioner right now. My hair, as you can see, guys, is very defined, very soft, very super soft. I'm going to be using their line today. So the one I wanna focus on is their pudding, but I'm just gonna go ahead and show you the conditioner. Okay, and as you can see, it says coconut oil repairing conditioner for dry, damaged, or color treated hair. So, my hair is not specifically damaged, but obviously, it is color treated. So, I want to put as much moisture back into my hair. That leads me on to the product, the styler that I'll be using, and I'll be using it by itself. And it is this, and it's the coconut oil curl styler cream pudding. I paid $5.99 for this, which I say is reasonable. A lot of these hair creams, I do think they're overpriced. But this one, I have opened it and the consistency is really thick. Basically, less is more, guys, with this one. That's what it looks like in the lid. It's got like just like a creamy consistency. But what I noticed, so using this small amount, as soon as I put it on my hair, look at that. Can you see that, guys? It is super defined. It's almost, almost feels like a hair grease. I don't know how it's going to be once it's dried. I will be blow drying today, not diffusing. So, you see that definition guys? Can you see that moisture? So this I feel is something I've been looking for a long time. So, this is what it looks like inside guys. That's what it looks like inside. It's kind of like, it says it's a pudding. It's kind of like bouncy. And I think that's all you need to do. You just need to tap to get that mount to put on your hair. So, I'm going to go ahead and wet my hair because that's when products take the most in wet hair so I'm gonna section my hair as I usually do guys and I'm not gonna talk for this video I'm just gonna style my hair and you can just carry on watching Okay guys, so that is one side done. And as you may be able to tell by my facial expressions, I am impressed so far. I don't wanna go over the mark because obviously I don't know how it's gonna dry. But guys, can you see this definition? 
Oh my gosh. Even these parts of my hair are straighter on this side and it's it's just giving it such life. Look at that. Shiny. Obviously I started on the ends as well guys because obviously so my hair is coloured and I want to pay as much attention to the ends as possible. Right. So I'm going to go ahead and do the other side guys. Okay, so this is how my hair is looking at the moment. Oh wow. I am loving this. So I didn't use too much at all. Money wise, I think that's pretty good. So how much I use? Not a lot. It doesn't really smell coconutty to me. It's got um I kinda I don't know, I can't put my finger on it. But it doesn't really smell like coconut, but yeah. So I'm gonna go and blow dry this now guys so this is the look when it's wet and the product's been applied so I'm gonna blow dry and I'll get back to you okay guys so what do you think these are the end results I found my staple guys I have found my staple it is soft it's bouncy Woo! it's juicy it's moisturized Palmer's coconut oil they're doing their thing. They know what they are doing with this one. Oh. This is called a Palmer's Coconut Oil with Vitamin E and it's got raw coconut oil for dry, damaged or colour treated hair. So if you've got any of those, this is the one guys. No sulphates, no parabens, mineral oil, no gluten, no dyes. This is Palmer's Coconut Oil Curl Styler Cream Pudding instantly, yep. Boost, hydration and add shine, yep transforming dry frizzy hair into bouncy defined curls absolutely it says maximizes curl length for longer lasting styles yeah i think i'm gonna wear this for if i have a really good wash and go i can get away with it for maybe close to seven days right it doesn't feel tacky on my hand i didn't use it with any leave-in because i think if i'm going to use this as a st styler and it's got so many oils in it already i just kind of i didn't actually buy a leave-in to be honest because the leave-ins that i use are usually when i apply gel to my hair so guys thank you so much for watching if you do have any questions or comments you can leave them down i was going to say downstairs you can leave them down in the comment box i will put details of the products in the description box down below and you can follow me on all my social medias, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Miss Lauren Lee 11, Snapchat Ms. Lauren Lee 11. Don't forget to subscribe today, guys. I do weekly videos Mondays and Thursdays at 4 p.m. So subscribe now, hit the notification bell so you don't miss another video. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.